Well, hello, my YouTube family. I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with everybody. So, I got two great big windows on the front of my house. But first, look how cute this is. I bought this for my puppy. My kitty cats have one, but it's out in the other room. And, oh, the two windows I have outside, I picked two themes. One... I'm going to do Merry Christmas, and underneath of them, I'm going to do Ho Ho, and an Elf. These are so cute. You just got to watch, though, because, like, these little things right here, they tend to want to bust off. You got to be careful with them. And my second big window, I am actually going to do... These two great big snowflakes, and I'm going to do a snowman theme that they had. All these were at the Dollar Tree. Aren't these so cute? Right now I have a Thanksgiving theme on my window. So, I thought this was adorable. We had to tuck his head in and his feet up so he fit back in the bag. This will be when after Thanksgiving there where this is going on my windows. I just think these are so cute. Dollar Tree's got some good stuff. They always do. Oh, and I have them put away, but I actually got boxes again and started doing... Oh, and of course these. Isn't this cute? <laughs> I wanted to pull my hair back and my hair clips were kind of getting on my nerves because they weren't really decorative. So I picked these up when I was there. And um, I got square boxes. I bought a gold one, a silver one, and a red one for my grandsons and put candy and stuff in them and like a little squishy thing and a little squishy monster looking thing and just random stuff. Welch's fruit thingies they can chew on. And then the two girls, I got two red ones. My two twin granddaughters. So then, well, I might as well do my Walmart haul while I'm sitting here too. Ugh. So then I went to Walmart, and I freaking love the men's section for shirts. My husband loves the 100% cotton. And when you see me with my Americana shirts, that's usually where they're from. If I don't remember, it didn't happen. This is a shirt for my husband for Christmas. And he also likes skulls and different things like that. He always likes horror things. So I got him this. And you can't beat these either. Because they're only like five dollars. I mean, some are some run seven. You just gotta look at the prices. But these here, see this, four dollars and ninety-seven cents. You just gotta look at the back where they have the shirts and the logos, or they have like a thing that kind of. I don't think it really spins, but it looks like one of them spinners with pockets. And I think both of these. So yeah, this one's for. 97 do. So they were cheap. So that's what I bought with my cheap haul this time. And I just had to come share it with you guys. Oh. Oh. And I forgot to show you guys this. Because Rennie's birthday is coming up December 3rd. My puppy plus Christmas. I found these at the Dollar Tree too. I have to hide them from her though. Because she sees these. She'll go nuts. But look how cute this it's an ice cream cone. And it squeaks. <laughs> and I can't squeak any of them because she's actually laying in front of me on her pillow. She just can't see me because of my makeup stand. So I started her birthday shopping. And um, I think what I'm going to do start starting in January, well, I'm going to have a big giveaway because, you know, it's my birth month. So it's probably going to be... The second bit biggest since the Christmas giveaway. And I think I'm going to change things around. Um, instead of having giveaways like every time I reach a certain number. Because YouTube you don't really climb that fast. And honestly I don't know where my channel is going to go. I just have fun doing it. So I decided that what I might do is just pick maybe like a comment of the month. So if you comment on my channel and I might leave a secret word or something, 
that, you know, you guys will have to know that secret word when the time comes for the drawing. I might, I'm thinking about doing like maybe one product a month, like a palette or maybe like a set of lip glosses. And if it's something you have and you don't want to, you don't have to participate because when I participate in giveaways, I always, I never participate in the ones I already have the stuff unless I'm like out of it. <laughs> and then, you know, if I run out, then I'll, you know, go into the giveaway if I want another, if I want it again, that is. But like, cause like I like, say for instance, like I like the Modern Renaissance palette, but right now I have a brand new one. So when I see them, I'm not going to join those giveaways. But if I was like hitting pan and almost out of it and I wanted another one, then yeah, I might participate. But I try not to participate in giveaways so other people can have chances. I guess I'm just not greedy that way. But anyways, I'll be back in a bit because there is a palette that I want to undo and actually do a makeup thing tonight too. So I will return. Mwah! <laughs> 